Hello, in this video I like to show you how I updated the firmware for the Arcbird OSD Autopilot from version 3.1020 to the latest version of 3.1028 you can update from 20 to 28 25 to 28 as well First, you will need the USB to TTL adapter so you can connect to your computer. I hooked up the uh, red cable to 5 volt, brown cable to ground, green to RX, blue to TX. Then you hook it up to the Arcbird side. power and brown going to the middle pin of TX okay so TX pin you power in the middle Blue is the TX. TX is going to RX. RX is going to TX. Like that. Then at the program port, you need a jumper to jump the bottom two pin. Now you're ready to hook up to your computer. Then you will need to install the driver called CP210X VCP for Windows. You'll see the link at the bottom to download the driver. Mine 64 bit. This is 32 bit. Mine 64 bit. I run that. Click next, click accept, click next. Now it says ready to use. Click finish. <clears throat> Once the driver is installed, connect USB to your computer. Then run a program called mcuisp.exe. You'll see the, the link at the bottom of this description. Click run. Mm -hmm. Now press the button on the Arcbird OSD for writing. Press that button once. Then you click read chip info. The chip info would display something like this. With a 96 bit unique ID device. You need to send this ID to Arcbird support, then they will send you the latest version of the firmware. Once you get the firmware from the Arcbird support, you can go ahead and select the Arcbird latest firmware. Then you can just click start ISP button. When you click this button, it will erase your firmware and writing with the latest firmware uh, version. I hope 
this is easy for you to follow thank you for watching